Hey guys, so I'm, I'm down in downtown Manila. Um, and actually you have to get some pants prepared and I'm at an old little street market. If you want to see what it's like there, definitely keep on watching. Morning guys. So I made it up to uh, Manila and I've been in Manila actually for two days. I, I haven't been able to make a video in a little bit because um, I've been trying to get this motorcycle and I had some problems with my phone and had to reset some stuff with my signal and um, just to I actually had to help out this one guy because he needed to find a flight back home. An older gentleman who didn't know how to use the internet much. So uh, I helped him book that out. And we got we got a lot of the stuff done, but um, anyway, I'll, now it's you know it's day two here, and I got everything taken care of. I'm actually I got the bike, and I'm going to go uh, ride the motorcycle out out west here pretty soon, go to the beach and whatnot. What I was trying to say was uh, basically I was trying to get a motorcycle. I got one. And last night, you know, I was running around, I met this local guy, he showed me some cool bars and stuff. Um, that was actually a lot of fun. But um, when, when I did do that, I, um, I was wearing my long pants, you know, when I wear my, when I ride bikes and wear motor or boots and pants. I was wearing my long pants and they're actually nylon and they got burnt a little bit uh, from, uh, you know, from the, the engine. So uh, this morning, I found this little marketplace, and I'm actually going to show you guys that right now. That's what this video is about. And there, um, there I, uh, I found someone to stitch up my pants. You know, it cost uh, 150, 150 pesos, which is around, I want to say, dollar thirty or so. So pretty good. Um, last minute, I found two people. One person, he, he was too busy, so he couldn't do it today. The other person said that she could do it, um, so that worked out. And then this market's a cool like produce market. They have fish, they have fruit, they have clothing and a few things. Um, but yeah, it's a cool little market in, in Manila. So I'll show you guys that. If you want to stick around for the next video, I'm going to be riding the motorcycle out to the country, leaving Manila, uh, and just going to check out you know some beaches, maybe some waterfalls and caves. But I'm super excited to go explore and kind of get out of the city. Uh, and kind of an annoying, but fun, you know, a little bit annoying, but fun past day or two uh, in Manila. Uh, I was just really excited to get on the trip. Now that I've found a little bit quieter of a street to walk down, 
um, yeah, it was super cool to, you know, like explore out this little market and stuff. But um, yeah, so what really happened was last night, I finally got a hold of a motorcycle and I'm trying to ride a motorcycle around the Philippines and explore some of the, uh, maybe see some rice tariffs or some waterfalls or go to the beaches, you know, kind of get out of the city, get out of the, uh, the hustle and bustle up here. But what happened last night is I went out and I actually met this cool, uh, cool local guy to show me some cool bars and exploring around and whatnot. Um, but when I was riding the motorbike, I'm wearing these, if you've seen my, um, my Columbia pants, the pants that I wear, I made a nylon and on my right leg it actually touched the, the bike a little bit and got a little bit burned or singed. So I was a little bit annoyed. I'm like, oh, I have to go you know, get some new pants. But then I thought, you know, maybe I can get them tailored. They're a little loose anyway. So um, this morning I found this little, well, last night I asked a local and uh, she told me how um, there was this market. And at this market, you can go and they can like tailor up your pants or tailor or fix something. I'm like, perfect. You know, I was looking for something like that, so that worked out. Uh, I went through this morning, I went to the first guy and he said he couldn't do it because it was too short of notice. Then I went to another stall just around the corner from him and this lady said she could do it right then. She said it would be 150 pesos, which I thought was a fair price. Um, one peso or one US dollar is about 52 pesos. So to get my pants tailored last minute, it's gonna cost me about $3. For a dollar, dollar, yeah, two dollars and like 40 cents or so. So that's super convenient. And then, um, yeah, I'll, I'll be able to you know, get those, get those all squared away and then I'm gonna get on the bike, you know, get checked out of my hostel and go explore on the, East Coast a little bit. So if you guys want to see, you know, what some of Manila's like, not Manila, Manila's this big city um, in where you fly into, there's like 10 million or so people here. But if you want to see what life is like outside of Manila, and you want to see, you know, what the Philippines is like in the country, or, you know, what a motorbike trip would be like leaving the city here, um, you know, definitely stay tuned. In the next video, I'll be going over all that. But uh, yeah, guys, hope you like this video and NST never stop traveling. Peace out.